And no, rise there. Rise. Oh, oh he hits two. Goodness. And this is the power of the Annihilator. It's so clutch for these situations. But Karma does pick up Octane. Now it's a 2v3. Huge, huge play there for Karma to be able to get that. He's 12 and 7. You couldn't have asked for a better matchup from him. Who is focused right now? They, they have, Optic has to do something. Yep. And their play, as you can see on the screen, I'm not going to call it out because I don't know how good the soundproofing is here. So but we're just going to stick with it. Now 1v3 for Karma. Yeah, He's all alone in the bomb. He's down on A. Okay, Karma's doing behind him. He finds one. Bomb's down. He and does not have to do time to work time. with. This Someone from Rise just needs to run away. Someone this could very well be GG. This is it. Yep. This is it. It's going to be over. Rise will be the winners, ladies and gentlemen, of your Totino's Invitational. Congratulations. Defeating Optic Gaming in round 11 in and this epic search and destroy matchup. Uncap on the board to kind of save face. He's got a tempest out as well. Pre-fires out with it. The timing was just off. He's going to be taken down. Fates dropped as well. That's all four players down for Tana Myers. And I think that is definitely going to be a way to wrap up this CTF. You're going to see more kills coming out of Dens. Last five seconds. No one's over here to do anything. You can see Tana Myers have given up. Mind Freak take the CTF 5-0 and they take the grand final 4-0 against Tainted Mind. Here, presented by PS4, is complete. It is going to be your champion's Mind Freak. Potentially pushing from the defensive side of things could break this That's up. That's another one. It's four versus two. They're able to pick up one kill. All of a sudden, 2v2. They're picking him up. It's now four down. is nine and seven in game seven but i tell you what and there it is optic gaming are going to be your champions of stage one north american call of duty world league Gump. He's going to get that bomb down, slide on out. Tommy and Swanee coming in. Swanee coming on the wall run. He's taken down. Tommy, Tommy attacks. He does pick it up, and he's got the HCXD as well. Tommy desperately needs to stay alive. Jerd needs to pick up the kill. Jerd goes down. Tommy now alone with Madcap. Madcap the only one. He picks up the kill. 1v2. He needs to stay alive. And Optic Gaming takes the SD 6 2, and they win here up against Millennium. Give it up. It is the crowd invitational champions. Opti Gaming! I see them go up against Millennium this morning and... Uh, well, oh, see! Just... See! How is that fair to anybody involved? At, at this point, we are just past the point of understanding how a team is this... Just, it doesn't really miss shots. <laughs> it's just phenomenal play out of Opti <laughs> time and time again. The shots raining in. Optic Gaming are going to be your ESWC 2016 champions with a 3 0 sweep on the splice in the last game of the tournament. They came, they saw, they laid the smackdown. Optic Gaming knew they were a championship Sunday team. Right to the wire, but America just proved to be too much. I mean, thinking about the other American teams, how do the likes of FaZe bounce back from this? Because that's the big upset for me. Um, I feel like FaZe are sitting there trying to like reprove themselves every single event, but every single time they're underperforming. This could be everything for the side of Elevate. You got one in the corner, can't win the gunfight. That Scumpy winning it. Carmen might be coming on the flank. Let's get back to Vicento. Is he able to trade the kill? He cannot. Camo comes around the back. He's off the map. It's all on Aqua. Do or die. The heat wave in. There's one. Where's Formal? He's behind. Can't locate. There's so little time to work with. He sees him in the corner. He's got to push him. He has to make a play. Formal trying to stay away, and that should be it. He's got around the back. There's not enough time to work with. And Optic Gaming has done it. A tremendous play by Formal there just to stay alive. Optic Gaming are your 2016 MLG Anaheim Open champions. It's going to be the final seconds. Get a shot of the guys there. It's going to be Nimble with the drone trying to get in through that big door. 
He's going to have Zeus clearing players out, but at this point, it's just too little, too late. He tries to get in. He's going to get Heat Wave by Dens. Dens picks up one. Fido with another. Mind Freak, 10 seconds left from closing this one out. Dens is just getting jiggy with it at the end. What a way to celebrate. The boys are already up. Last few seconds. Mind Freak are going to take the uplink 13 to 5. They are your Sage 2 champions for the ANZ Pro Division. Urban's gonna fall off the map, the one-point play comes in, 40 seconds, zero. zero! Zero, the goalkeeper has this, and number six has gone down to his tummy! I if don't used, believe it. They can wrap this, they can save the day machine, 30 seconds to go. One-point play has never meant so much, the championship rides on zero shoulders, no. and he's gone down! Jerk gets the kill, his brains are everywhere, and so are ours as we try and cast these final seconds. 20 seconds, Tommy, what can you do? Or what can Marky B do? Did he get out for the reset? I, I think, think he did, I think that's it, I think Millennium have done it! They have, it's on the roof, 15 seconds! Can reset. I think that's over. Eight to seven. The time ticks down. There's no one there. It's game over. G G Millennium do retain God Squad status. Infuse already there to shake their hands. What a game. What a journey. And what a ride this has been. Tommy and Jared, your champions are Millennium. Well, Envy would have to go on a crazy streak of scores here in the final second. Then, oh, even oh, then, they may not have enough time. And Karma playing pretty well in the objective game modes. Games three and four, he has really showed up for Optic Gaming, making some clutch plays. You have an insane reverse sweep in the first best of five. Absolutely outrageous stuff. And now Optic firmly taking control. 20 seconds left, and this is done. John doing all he can, but there's just simply not enough time. The second best of five is going to be a big 3-0 for the green wall. Yeah, out the game, he comes out, completely dominates here on fringe uplink. It was never really close. The search and destroy was a blowout, so was the uplink. And that is it. One second left, it ticks away. And there you have it. Optic Gaming are your MLG Orlando 2016 champions. With the trophy, smiles on their faces. at back-to-back -back MLG trophies for the Optic Gaming squad. Yeah, and they have really proved themselves to be the best team in Black Ops 3. A lot of times, Shakehap is running home free down the brick side of the map, and it's a hellstorm from Raided. He's able to get two, but it's still all up to Bance to try and get in here and make a play. I don't think there's enough time. 15 seconds left. You don't have enough time to get back and grab the fourth. Envious have done it. It's going to be raided mid-map, picks up one, but he knows the game is over. And there you have it. Team Envious are your 2016 Call of Duty World League champions. And their check, $800,000. On behalf of Treyarch and Activision, we have some new world champions. Never been more pressure on Assault to make a play. And he's able to catch him actually planting the bomb. Now can he close on one more? He's able to win it. Now gonna be one versus one. He sees him. He's trying to challenge. Whips around, loses it, but almost, almost insanity. This nation are your 2016 MLG Vegas champions hit straight through B. That's the type of aggression I would like to see. Our cities picks up one. Pristini with another. Silly in a perfect position here. One more player it's alive. It's done. Just like that. You see the disappointment on the faces of Optic. And look at the hype from E United. Lost that is, but you have to focus on the champions. There they are. Look at the squad. E United proved all the doubters wrong, Matt. Yes, team one. And uh, now oh, they're God. back. I'm eating my words. I'm eating my words. Give him 40. He tags him up, doesn't finish it. Surely, no, not able to do it yet with 15 seconds left. There's nothing left to talk about. Optic Gaming oh, has done my it. God. 3 0 oh, as formal kills the entire team in the base, baby. This is sick stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, it is over. Optic Gaming are your CWL Paris Open champions in dominating that. Gaming takes home the majority there, $40,000 again. Your CWL Paris Open champions, Optic Gaming. Side of observation, 
does not pick up one. It's going to be Crim6 picking up another. Dunless is out. Silly is gone. Just the twins left. Down goes Arsenis. Down goes Prestidious. All off the gaming. The trophy right away. In the first game five, he was incredible. They end up losing it. The biggest moment for Optic Gaming in the second best of five. Build for Luminosity. Already 15 seconds off the clock. LG are going to have to move, and they're going to have to move quick. Jerd with the first challenge. First blood for Splice. More players from Luminosity charging on it. Woo! Still did make it three. One versus three. Goodbye with a continent on their back. Splice are the champions of the Call of Duty World League Stage 1 presented by PS4. History has been made. But it is spliced. The hugs are out. The smiles are in. There you have it. Give them a round of applause. Splice, your stage one playoff champions. They just need one break and two points to secure two best of fives over Envy in the grand final and take home $200,000. Here it is. They get the kills. Everyone dead. Optic Gaming, your CWL Stage 2 Global Pro League champions. It's your champions. Give it up for them. Optic Gaming. Here's the overdrive. Pop, is he just trying to back him up? Make it all the plays. It's Grim 6. The curse has been broken. The dynasty has been cemented. They are the greatest roster in Call of Duty history. Optic Gaming are officially the Call of Duty World League champions. Theory with first blood. Challenges now coming in from Splice to Smoke, trying to aid them here. Theory with two. Mad Cat to even the numbers back out. It's all down to Tommy, the veteran, trying to stay alive. TK with their first major land championship. They get the job done in game five, and there is a new team, a top competitive call of duty. There you have it, Team Caliber are your CWL Dallas Open champions. Does appear so. They've got to get a pinch developing, and it looks like it's slowly coming. It's from Octane. Can't believe he survives that. Playing middle map, Octane's been spotted. Chino with one, now a three on three. Still possible to win this if you're TK. Octane dead, one final hope. It's Slack, he's been spotted, he's been eliminated, and Team Caliber will go back to back as they are crowned your CWL New Orleans Grand Champions. CWL New Orleans Champions. Get out of that hill. These are big gunfights going down. Rise Nation, they just might do it here. Rise Nation looking to ice the game. Red spawning 50 out. 50 kills for Gunless. 50 bomb on the board. 44 on the other side for Joe. But Rise Nation now five seconds away from taking this grand final. The final ticks are in, and Rise has done it. LG, they have a solid setup. Octane, though, he's going to get naded. Nice shots from Bance as he finds two. Jordan with another. There's just one player left, and that's Slacked. What could Slack do while well, he finds two? And it's just every it. single situation, LG's coming out on top. This could be it. 30 seconds remaining on the hard point. Five seconds needed for LG. The splice win. The dream is dead. Luminosity gets the victory. They are your CWL Birmingham champions. Please give it up for your champions of CWL Birmingham, Luminosity Gaming. He distracts two players from Optic for nearly 40 seconds. And now Formal and Scump have got to clutch here for a chance to extend this game five, this final and crucial map. Replays, he's got position up top. Spots come for a moment. Formal's able to get the pick. It's a two versus two. Priesta, he's been the hero in this round for phase thus far. He finds another kill. It's Priesta working on the ace to close this out. Scum sitting through mid map, doesn't have time to work with. And phase clan! Phase clan for the first time!
since the season three playoffs of Advanced Warfare in 2015 are your champions. Up 6-0 with two and a half minutes left. I would be asking my team where they wanted to go out to dinner after this championship. They're still pulling flags. They're still pulling flags. We're trying to ramp up this lead. But thankfully, ay, uh, that's probably Aix's body. That is probably Aix's body. No love between <laughs> Slasher and Aix. No, and if you're EG, a they're stellar performance. But they're going to look at that. Ray is on the flank. Fighter pilot in. Oh, and, and Ray gets taken out. And now all of Red Reserve are inside cave. They're all bunched up in cave. Slasher is going to get pressured. He's got Gunless at the top. Rise Station are holding. Rise Station are holding. They may be able they to get, get out. W here, but the contest has come in. Four points needed for Red. Ready to get two. for Rise. The day comes out of Moody. Moody with a three piece. Zero. He just has to dive on in. Zero's been the hero. That's it. it. This time, Rise Nation with the victory. To back champs, Rise Nation are your CWL Anaheim champions. Oh, somehow have a miraculous break in the Doc's warehouse. Here you go, Dad. I, I think that's it. Four seconds left. They're not even gonna get close. TJ's the only player up. He gets taken down. TK, lower Doc's warehouse just popped. Five, able to find one. Four, three, two, one, and that is it. Team Caliber get it done. No three-peat for Eyes Nation Game Series, and now they can hoist the trophy. Team Caliber are your Stage 2 Playoff champions. They didn't even make Stage 2 Playoffs, Clint. They were one map away from not even making it to bracket play, but the boots are back on the ground. Aches, once again a world champ. That's two rings for Aches, two rings for Apathy. And welcome to the club, silly and assault, as evil geniuses, as an organization, get that first world championship like that. There's the trophy. There's the win. Evil geniuses are your 2018 Call of Duty World League champions. Two. I got a little excited. He didn't actually hit the shot for the rest of the team. Oh! There's the 180 as he connects. And now only four lives remaining. You can feel it coming. The bar is building after a year of pain. Here it is. There it is. Optic Gaming back on top. We have it. Slacked another big one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, the grab slam still from Slacked. Is he gonna use it yet? No. So Splice should be able to get in here, but let's watch that mini-map. We'll see if the rotation comes in. Uh, LG does not win here. They don't win here, but there's a player. Formal's already rotated. Can Formal stay alive? Here they come, here they come. He's tucked in the pocket, he does just that. Tags up a second as well. Gunless now in with the help. They only need two seconds. That may do it. There's one player remaining. He is dead, and there's the championship. That'll do it. Your CWL forward 2019 champs more seconds, sip finds three, they have to contest. Slasher with the war machine, he gets taken down. They United. can't win here, they cannot win here. E United are in though, and they've got the left side of the minimap. This one's going down to the wire, Joe. Sip's got the war machine up, big one on one win by Enable. On the Clayster, he's gonna get him up top. You have to get off the hill. If you're a United, you have to get off of it. You have to rotate inside of this house. Sip behind his war machine, can he break? He's only gonna get find one and get taken down. But the trades, they're coming through. Can you know with the headshot? They're in the hard point. Just two more points needed. There's no contest. And we've got a new champion. It is what our thieves that do it. And 100 Thieves, they're making their push. Their championship push right here. 
What a cluster! It's actually gonna connect on two. Slasher drops him. Five seconds needed. Can 100 Thieves do it? Nobody there for Gen G, and that's back to back. Evan, 100 Thieves go back to back. 100 Thieves are your 2019 CWL Anaheim champs. The championship. You can feel it. They're soaring at him. Life by life. Genji drop. Havoc, though, with the grab slam through. There's only five more from Genji and the contest there. Just for a moment, they'll get onto the site. They have to be perfect from this point. Vision pulse in, though, for me and Adi. You know where they're at. Envoy goes aggressive. He's able to take down one Mox. Almost able to stay alive. Here we go. It's down to three. The contest is in for me, United. One life left. It's just Major Maniac. E United have done it. E United have done it. We've got a new champ. And for the first time in 1,400 days, Clayster will hoist a trophy. E United are your 2019 Pro League champs. You have numbers here for a moment. Slasher was picking up the flank, but now he comes back in. Pristini takes down two. It can all end here. It's on Octane. It's on Slasher. The United do it. They go back to back. A storybook ending as E United are your 2019 Call of Duty World League. Chance. Krim 14 and 30, Matt 3. Not a great performance. Yeah, for him. I, I think we first pointed out he was like 2 and 10. He started. <laughs> Alec Arsene still torching bodies as the final seconds tick away. That does it. Chicago Huntsman are your winners at the London Home Series final. seconds Florida cannot allow FaZe to keep the B Hill it could be another crazy game a simple finds two Prestini does finally trade but time's ticking you've got to go you've got to go if you're Florida and Sally I'm just trying to kill as many players as possible anyone that sets foot on B FaZe is going to swarm Florida they have no options they have to flood the flag 20 seconds left Six point game. B's now being de kept. A huge 1v1 is going to go down over towards C, but the kill feed is predominantly red. The de kept towards B, but I think Florida realized they have to go. They have to push. They need to get everything. There's no time. There's no time at all left for Florida. And Atlanta Faze defend their city. They will take the Atlanta home series. A wonderful, wonderful performance from Faze. A 3 0 victory. Bomb going down. Boot though. Who's gonna find that player? And I love that he stays alive. Illy gets a snipe over him. It's all down to the reef tank. It's a 1v3 for assault. That's it. Assault is down. And with the defuse for Illy and the smile from Shotzi, we have ourselves a new champ. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the Dallas Empire, the victors of your Los Angeles Home Series event. If they are set up, this could be the game, the match, the weekend right here. Florida Mutineers looking to get their first Home Series win on the year, just 10 points away. The last time they were here, they fell short. They had to go through Chicago both times to get here, and this time, they might seal the deal right as they go to do it. The contest comes in, but now the victory lap. Florida Mutineers, your Dallas Home Series victors, they get it done. But it's gonna happen. Can they have a near perfect hold? No, Shotzi and Hook hit four. Hook with the fifth, and that could be it, Maven. Shotzi and Hook go huge. The contest is there for a second, but it's not enough. 
It's the Dallas Empire with their second home series win. He's trying to break through. The contest is going to need to come in very, very quickly. Slasher slides in somehow, some way. Optic still in this as they break once again. Two points needed for Atlanta Phase on board with Simp. Can he be the difference maker? It looks like he's going to play it smart. Wait for his teammates. Unfortunately, they're already tagged up. So may have to reevaluate how he wants to try and break through. Sean is out of the pinch right now. His teammates mid map died. Everyone coming through the back door. Simp by himself, but Poppy slides in. Can only find one in the kill feed. Stays green on the left side. Optic still in it now, but look at the rotation. rotation. Everyone for phase set up to new. You need a miracle kill feed here if you're Optic gaming. Does number seven, number seven, no, Wombo. number seven killed him. Number oh. seven killed him at the old hill. Won the one-on-one -on -one gunfight in the final moments. And with Selling. three seconds left on the point, steals the game from Optic who were thinking, we got to rotate, we got to rotate, which is correct. But you got to win the gunfights in the hill, so Atlanta steals it away. Rest of them up. The Huntsmen have got this map locked down. Hackney Yard may be in London, but right now it's shy town, baby. They are not letting this go. Again, the push now from the rear from the Huntsmen. They can hold on to the top side. The Ravens trying to make the entries, but the kill feed is just pure Huntsman, man. It's disgusting. Yeah, the Huntsmen are, are absolutely tearing this one. And going into the Seattle home series, a lot of people doubted them. People looked at Minnesota, New York, Seattle themselves, even everyone in in-between. But the Huntsman reign supreme as only two points is needed. It is going to go to the Huntsman, and they are the champions today. That band of brothers reunited. The Huntsmen get it done. They will be your Seattle home series finals champions. It's a three-man stack right now from FaZe. Can they hold on? They can win it here. Well, both teams can, and that's four dead. Major Maniac, he's going to win the mid AR battle at Tire Shop. They have spawns uh, if we go the distance. And two of them spawn top Tire Shop. I don't know if Skies was ready for that, so two FaZe members going to be there. They've got Tire Shop control. They're, all They're in. set up in Board position to take in. it, but Mutineers can still win it. You can't even think about the spawns for next. You've got to close it out here if you're Mutineers. You've got to do it. 13 points now away from victory. If they look to hold off the phase onslaught, you set it perfectly. They are all in now, and they can do it. They've gotten the kills. Simp is going to be the last person here. He's got to try and disrupt. They just need a couple more ticks. Can phase contest? They've gotten in for now, but there's the clearance from the Mutineers, and there's the win. They they hold off the late surge from FaZe and they will get their second home series win. It'll be impossible. The FaZe players, <laughs> oh yeah, Priester, we feel you, brother. We do. They're it's hiding by back brick. They have literally had to throw in the towel. What it, it's like Chris Griffin, like, stop it, he's already dead. He's dead. FaZe have been absolutely beheaded in this series and the florida mutineers my god man they have uh, taken over yeah. the call of duty league <laughs> let's just watch a boat for a second <laughs> let's all just take a big deep breath and look at the absolute stomping that was the finals of the paris home series the previous record was 105. This absolutely smashed it. What a performance it was. Congrats to Temp on his first win. Mac, his first win. Subliners do it for the first time. The second team all year to win their home series event. It's just a round of applause. A celebration for Subliners. They have done it. Congratulations. Subliners take the event. 20 seconds to go. You've got to be decisive here if you're ultra. You've got to find an opening. Kleenex has a massive gunfight here, and he's able to win it. Abizi's going to get dropped. The Dead Silence is going to reset now for Kleenex. Three versus three. Bomb getting planted. Rallying over is going to be phase, oh. and now they've got to make the retake happen. Three versus three. Kleenex is able to get away with his life. Meth is with his second kill of the round. It's down to Major Maniac and Priesta to come up with the clutch. Major Maniac's tagged up. Priesta makes it a two versus two. Can they find Priest the opening? Got three on the round. Priest has got three on the round. What else can he find? 25 seconds, seven and a half seconds to defuse. Here goes Major Maniac. It's Kleenex to deal with. He finds the opening. It's 1v1. It's 1v1. And Methods clutches again. He goes huge for Ultra. And they get their first home series victory. The flood's going to be on through. Shot what? through the smoke for Krim. What? Krim is making the play. Krim will drop. But he does the damage. He's been massive in this series. 
Maze on Cell. You have play going all the way around. Shotzi gets the call out. Shotzi makes the two versus four. Second, FaZe's dream of a championship is disappearing. Every window, every door, there's somebody. It's a ludicrous gunfight win for Sim, but will it be enough? Just 12 seconds to go. Seemingly nothing that he can do, and there's the final kill. Dallas Empire, get it done. They are your 2020 Call of Duty League champions. Prim6, now undisputedly the greatest Call of Duty player of all time. Clayster goes back to back to get his third chip as well. And for the youngsters in Illy, Hook, and Shotzi, their lives are forever, forever changed. Before retakes. All right, you're not, you're just separated now. They, they find the openings. Here comes the rotations. It's happening again. Hello. It is all down to Krim. 12 and 3 as Sim. Well, Maybe a little vengeance for the loss at the World Championship last year. Some extra love onto the members as Krim is getting swarmed, hunted, and he will drop phase. They dominate the search and destroys. They're flawless on the map. And that was just a clinic in search, Joe. One of the easiest games in the hill to hold, and they have to do it for the championship. Insight right now just needs to stay alive. His teammates have the coverage that he needs. A busy though, looking for the intro, and he goes as fast as he can. Can't find the kill. Insight still alive. It's 10 seconds for the win now. This is it. Ultra holding it down. They've got five seconds for the win. Sim's going to contest. He's going to get cut to pieces. And what do you know? The greatest underdog going into the tournament. They take the best team in the league the whole way, and they get the job done. Not only do they do it on a respawn, they truly are ultra as <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I cannot believe what we have seen today. Clay has to stay alive on the other side. Simpy's at least able to get one, and now you're just wasting time if you're Simp. Arsenis is there to help him. A 2v4 now for Atlanta Phase. And look to close it out as Seam gets gunned all on Clay. And it's done. Phase, their second win on the year. And my God, did they put a statement on it with that search and destroy. Get back and watch the flank for free all the way back garden. Get a man and Tiki and two in bedroom. In my mind, this is almost unbreakable. Empire, you got your work cut out for you. And they do the impossible. It felt like almost intentional. Vivid, first blood goes to Sim. Selling him still from that top bedroom position. Trying to overwhelm Simp on the inside, but that is Simp. You're trying to overwhelm, and he finds two. Shotzi, though, tries to bring it level. It's still a 3v2. Illy takes care of top bed. 2v2 right now. Shotzi looking to play forward, but it's a BZ there. Illy, last player left alive, and it's a two-man hit. And with that, Atlanta FaZe have finally done it. It is over. It is done. The perfect setup reigns supreme, and they get the job done. Dallas may be kicking themselves there. They almost had it. It was an incredible battle. D. The attacking team trying to control Kitchen. A Kami just so weak, but Major's gonna step on the bands. There is a quick trade. We're into a three on three. But Priest is in that spot and steady with all the way through ring, but such fast trades. 2v2. It's coming down to this attack. Yeah. Gonna hit. It's all on the Kleenex to keep Ultra in it. 30 seconds on the clock, and Kleenex has bomb. And he clutch up in the one versus two. He sees the wrap out. He's going to work the plant. Now it'll oh, be he's going to catch him out. Priesta, they're going to catch him. He gets away for now. 50 he's health, got no time. Just gets out he's got a plant. Time is dwindling. There's the end. Kleenex wins one. Attack finishes it. And it is done. The greatest comeback in the history of Call of Duty Esports. It's the Minnesota Massacre. As they get the dub. What a series on a locker, mentally to bounce back, being down 0-4. The crowd on their feet again. FaZe can feel it, they're putting Ultra away, they're stacking up deep, they're putting up down, they're into the blender. 15 for the chip. Cruise missile in. 
It's the finale on the main stage. He blows up his teammate, but it's not going to matter. There's enough time to deploy, but they'll get cleared out. But look at the minimap phase are in. It's the guts. It's the glory. It's the championship for phase. Legendary. Twenty-two and nine. You need to clean up kills. Vance has got him. That's a five spree for him. Go by the victory lap is in, and we saw the money hill last go around. Ultra, they look like they're gonna. End oh my game god! Right here, right now. And this is the most sublime vanguard we've seen yet. Two thirty-one to seventy-one. And Vance, what in the name of all things sacred? They are walking through them. Seattle Surge. I mean, they've got ten seconds chance to. It's all come to a close. The bubble has burst. The fairy tale has ended. Welcome back to reality. What a devastating performance. Toronto Ultra. They are your kickoff classic champions. Not going down. Spots him. Massive kill from Celium. That is an unbelievable first blood. Now the three remaining members of Optic have to now contend with the full might of phase. But Shotzi! What was that angle? The bomb doesn't get blasted! Stumpy flies in! Shuts in the outside! Abizi the last one up! And it's Dashi!